several of the guys got a bee in their bonnet and called each other up and said, we got to have a picnic at lunch tomorrow. And the chain of people called each other saying, you know, who's got picnic baskets? So who's got skewers? Who's got a little barbecue? Who's going to bring coal? Who's going to bring hot dogs? Who's going to bring marshmallows? Who's got those red and white checkered picnic table covers? you got to have. Uh, and uh, eagerly awaiting lunch the next day, everyone who was uh, had heard about it rushed out to the middle of the front lawn and spread out the red and white tablecloths set up the barbecue, poured the coal in, and it rapidly, very rapidly became apparent that, uh, oh yeah, we should have started the coals half an hour ago. And, and people said, I wonder if there's some way we can get them to burn faster. And so Brian got sent, because he was one of the favorites, to Mr. Quinn, a science teacher, to ask him for something to help start the fire. Uh, uh, Quinn rolled his eyes, but he gave him a plastic beaker of acetone and said, if anything will do it, this will. Of course, the coals were already trying to light. Brian bought the beaker of acetone back out, threw it onto the barbecue, which flashed up, lit the acetone on fire, lit the plastic beaker on fire, lit the barbecue on fire, lit the grass around it on fire, lit everything but the coals on fire, and everyone burst into action. Uh, lit Brian's tennis shoes on fire. So half a dozen people were trying to stamp on his feet and put out his burning tennis shoe. And he's dancing around like a madman. And other people are grabbing tablecloths and trying to beat out the fire where it's in the grass. And of course, acetone flashes off very quickly and it was under control in just about no time. But everyone was uh, dancing around as if we, you know, poured the acetone on an anthill. And, uh, after a while, we had our marshmallows and cold hot dogs and the morning bell rang and we put everything back in the cars and went back inside and on to our next class. 